How's it going guys? CC Chaos here, and today I'm doing a gun review for the Scar L in the division. So when we look at its stats, we see that damage is 855, the rate per minute is 625, and the magazine carries around 60 rounds. I came around a few problems in this gun. First off, the the magazines are way they're not enough bullets. Especially when you're in close range and you have to you're, a lot of you're doing with a lot of enemies. I found myself running out of bullets really quickly and it really screwed me over because I had to either switch to my secondary or try to get back and find somewhere to reload. And plus with the reload speed not being exactly the fastest, that was kind of a problem. Now of course this could be solved with just getting an extended mag attachment, but you know, just off the gun itself, the basic base model, that's some that's a problem that is pretty prevalent. So another problem I have with the gun is the accuracy. Now the gun is pretty accurate, you know, there's no no doubt about that. It's pretty accurate. It's just one of the main problems I have with the gun is that the accuracy at more to medium to long range is not very good. With its with its fire rate, you see that when it shoots up, it actually leans to the left. Like when you spray, it like goes up to the left, which you know, you expect the gun to go it to, you know, go up when you when you just spray it, you know. But it has kind of a lean to the left, which is kind of something to think to, to know about, to remember. Because if you're spraying down an enemy, there's a good chance, even if they're up close at you, you'll, your gun will go out of touch. You'll go out of the shot, and you'll actually like go and you'll shoot next to them, which can be a big problem, a real, really big problem. And you know, that's just that was just a huge problem that I faced when using this gun. So what I had to do was, of course, I just had to just just not f go fully automatic, like most guns, of course. So I just, you know, I just shot it in, in intervals, like you're supposed to. But that's just something to know, though, because not all guns go, it's a, every different guns go in different ways, in different patterns when you spray them. So just something to know, just to know, you know. But, um, yeah, the gun is fairly accurate in the gameplay, and I, I used it with no, I didn't put any attachments on the gun. I used it uh, bare bones. So that I could get a full feel for it, and yeah, I, I, personally, I wouldn't really recommend this gun. There's a lot better options in the game, even for this run level I am. Uh, but the gun, it's okay. It's not that bad, uh, but definitely not my primary. Even if that was my best gun, I don't think it'd be my primary because the range being kind of a problem, the, the factor of it having not enough bullets, which was a huge problem. I'd be stuck and we'd be bling, we'd be being shot at. Me and my teammates, and it just be we'd be screwed because either I'd run out of bullets and they're trying to rush us, and I'd have to reload, and and that just be a bunch of huge problems. Like of course you know I can switch to my secondary and all that, but that's still that's that's time that's time right there, and each second can really count in some situations. Like you see in the gameplay above that, there was many times I had to switch to my secondaries and my primary to try to you know get out of there and try to you know survive. But either way, guys, I really hope you enjoyed the video. I'm trying out a new format. Uh, I'm making different videos. I'm going to start going off a format now so I can actually have, like, scheduled uploads. And I'll talk, I'll talk more about that later, though. I might make a video about it if anybody really gives a shit. I don't think nobody really cares, so I might just do it. But either way, guys, I'll see you guys next time. Peace out. Season Chaos 01, signing out.